God bless you, beloveds. This is Bishop here again with your Daily Bread. And I want to speak to you from uh, this subject, What Belongs to God? It was a psalmist, David, that wrote these words, that the earth is the Lord's, the fullness thereof, and they that dwell therein, that all belongs to to God. It is really important to signify and recognize exactly what is his. And today I want to take you down a certain path to let you know that certain times we're holding, we're possessing, we're fretting, we're worrying over, we're anxious over what is not ours, what really belongs to him. Uh, the scripture that we want to point out today is in 2 Chronicles 20 and 15. And in it, the Lord speaks to us of what belongs to him that we might not always be cognizant of. He spoke to, amen, the King Jehoshaphat to say these words, Thus said the Lord unto you, number one, be not afraid, number two, nor be dismayed by reason of all these adversaries that are coming against you. For the battle is not yours. It does not belong to you, but it belongs to God. Just like the earth is the Lord, the fullness thereof, and all the people that dwell upon the earth belong to him, so does your struggle. Your battle is not your property. It's not yours to fight. So if you give God what belongs to him, which is the battle, he'll give you back what you don't have, which is called the victory. Again, the battle does not belong to you. Trust him. And if you do, you'll see his arm, you'll see his hand, and you will see his glory. And this is Bishop saying again, Emmanuel, Of a truth, God is with us. God bless you.